welcome to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching my my mommy's birthday. See you soon. I'm going to see you next time. Bye. I'm not. There you go. Can you see? Yeah, Daddy got. Hi guys, how are you doing? Hope you're having a lovely day. You're very welcome to this video if you are a returning subscriber and you're welcome to my channel if you are first time here. I do everything makeup and beauty. So I found this hack on Instagram, TikTok, and I just thought why not try it and record it and obviously get sort of like a real time result and obviously share it with you guys. It's basically achieving a colorful graphic liner look without actually using a colored eyeliner. Okay, so if you want to see the look and obviously what I come up with, please stay tuned and keep watching. Enjoy the video. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comment below and I will try my best to sort of break it down for you and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. See that this video is mainly about the makeup hat, I will fast forward to the main event. So we have now come to the main event, which is graphic liner without the liner. <laughs> right, so I saw this video on TikTok. I will insert it somewhere here. And it was basically this girl talking about applying graphic liner without the actual liner. So what she did was she had a pencil brush, micellar water, and it worked. So without further ado, we're just gonna dive into the hat. Gonna get my micellar water and I'll be back. Okay, I'm back with my micellar water. Now we are going to look for a pencil brush, micellar water, check pencil brush check this pencil brush is the one from BH cosmetics it is the number 106 I believe it came in a set that I bought from TK Maxx so I'm just gonna prep my lid just using the remaining concealer that was on the back of my hand one reason why I am not a fan of doing my eye after my face because I have such a small lid space I have to sort of raise my brows up to get the lid space and when I do that my fiber obviously kind of scrunches up and I get these lines and these creases in my forehead and that's very annoying so I'm gonna have to like sort of tilt my head all the way backwards for this and then I'm going to use my makeup forever professional Paris HD powder to set I thought this would be so cool because obviously it's summertime and you know like colors in summer is just the bomb diggity i'm actually very excited about this because colored eyeliners is something that i don't actually have in my makeup kit believe it or not so if this were like yo ah, you will not hear the end of it okay i'm just warning you guys now because prepare to be sick of me So lids are set using the Garnier Skin Active Micellar Cleansing Water. It's also good for sensitive skin. Okay, so I'm going in with my Be Perfect Carnival Palette with a Stacey Marie. And we're going to be using Funky. Okay, I am part excited, part nervous because I just don't want this to go left. She did this, so dip in the micellar water and then going with the pink show. Oh, I hope this works. Oh, I'm slightly scared, I'm not even gonna lie. Oh, can you can y'all see that? Wow, like yo, I am gobsmacked, okay? Okay, so I will do the rest of my eyes and I'll be back. <laughs> so let us continue with this situation, right? And then I'm just gonna blend this like into my eyebrows, if you must. I'm gonna clean that up as well, so fret not. And then we're blending, blending, blending. So I'm gonna clean that up.
I can't really talk when I'm doing this bit because it's very, very delicate. It's very sensitive. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with the pink shade, Funky. And then I'm going to go in with that pink and just blend it upwards. This is so different to anything that I would normally do. Ooh, I love it. So this is what we got at the moment. I'm actually feeling this. Okay, and then I'm gonna take a white pencil from Elf. And I'm just gonna make a like, small dot. So I, I am just going to now set my whole face. And then we're gonna blush. I'm going in with my matte, frankly, Scarlet blush. Just doing it on my cheek. I just sort of like high points because of the shape of my face. I like to take everything upwards and then add a bit on my nose. Okay, let's do lashes and I'll be back, okay? Okay, so guys, we have come to the end of the video and this is the makeup look that I created. Um, again, I thank you guys for watching. If you stay till this part of the video, Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and comment below. Let me know what your thoughts are. Let me know if you like uh, videos like this and let me know if um, you have any suggestions or any more hacks even that maybe you've concocted in your head but not brave enough to put it out or not brave enough to try it. Let me know. I will happily be your guinea pig and try it out. Okay guys, thanks again for watching and I will see you in my next video.